Hello, 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 lovely gems, and welcome back to Gems Life Live, and we're going to get into some things. Okay, okay, okay. Hello, lovely gems, and welcome back to Gems Life Live. Today, we're going to be talking about Asian the Bat, Asian Doll, one of my favorites, and we're going to talk about her and King Vaughn. Rest in peace, King Vaughn. So, you know, I have a video also out on my channel if you want to check it out, just giving a breakdown of their whole kind of journey together up until he passed away. Now, last night she wrote a number of tweets on Twitter, and one of them actually caught my eye. She said, I hate being drunk. Well, not word for word, but basically saying, I hate being drunk and shit because I actually called Vaughn. So she probably implied that she drank a little bit too much and she accidentally called Vaughn, like as if it was normal, like as if he was still here. And I'm not going to lie, it does feel kind of eerie. Um, I feel like he's still walking among us, like he hasn't completely crossed over yet because he still is upset about his death and probably still had a lot of things to accomplish and just how it went down. And 100 Track, his manager, is doing a lot of interviews now because he's all of a sudden promoting his rap, which I don't think anybody cares. We don't really want to listen to him but he's going around just saying a lot of stuff and it's like he doesn't care if he does business with NBA young boy and it's just crazy because it's like okay you're supposed to be Vaughn's manager and you're saying that you would do business with NBA young boy and honestly since his interview at the very beginning with academics right after it happened I just feel like I don't I think he shot himself like this is allegedly If you actually look back at the footage, there was some YouTubers that caught it as well. And I just feel like he tried to make himself in the mix more than he was because maybe he's like a double agent. So anyway, Asian Doll was really vocal about that back then too, saying how people didn't really help him and you know what, this is just crazy and you know what I mean? She was the first one to get a Von chain. And then all of a sudden, Lil Dirk did. And it's just, it really is a lot. Like, I feel like a lot of people missed all the little details because everything happened so quickly. Like, the sequence of them breaking up and going on and off. Then him starting to, you know, mess around with other girls. Then the NBA Youngboy thing with Gianna. And then it just spiraled out of control. And he also had a case with Lil Durk. So, like, a lot of conspiracy theorists would say that now Lil Durk will beat that case because I believe the other guy that was in the case with them is dead as well. And now Vaughn's dead. So, it's like, okay, so he could probably just, like, get it dropped either by saying it was one of them or just saying, like, there's too much going on because two of the other accused are dead. So, I'd like to get this case dropped or dismissed so we'll see how that happens but I believe he's still under those charges that him and Vaughn had in Atlanta so I feel like Asian Doll's really just sitting down now and processing all this she's living her life she was also texting about not loving any of the guys that she was with you know that she was with Jack Boy for a little bit and you know she dabbled around a couple other with a couple other guys but she said she didn't really care about them at all she didn't love them she's just been going through her shit trying to figure it out and it must be really hard you can imagine you know all these feelings that she still has for Vaughn and then still like trying to process his death and then still trying to maneuver through the world. She also um, retweeted something that Missy wrote was basically along the lines of like being in pain and people laughing at people's pain is crazy. And her talking about how she almost called Vaughn I just seen another tweet tonight that she put. She's like, I can't believe people are making jokes. Like, I didn't lie about that. I would never post that I'm trying to call Vaughn to, like, get people's attention, stuff like that. So, anyway, I just wanted to say that 
I really think Asian dolls should maybe talk to somebody, try to get these feelings sort out. And I feel like the blogs need to like lay off of her when she's just trying to vent on her Twitter. It is her platform. She can do whatever she wants. And I feel like she's been very engaging in Twitter since the very beginning of her career. So I don't think people should like think she's trying to get attention because she's always been on social media and that's just how she does her shit. So anyway, keep an eye out for Asian. Give her a prayer. And please leave a comment, subscribe, and like this video. And I'll be back with another Gems Life. Bye for